<laughs> Hi loves. It's been a long time since I've done a live where I'm really connecting and talking. I've done a little nature live recently. Um, and it's good to be back again. And what's inspiring me at the moment is we just passed sort of new beginnings. There's been recent time in our solar journey uh, that I celebrate as Imolk, this time around February 1st, 2nd. It's a time of new beginnings. It's a time of remembering uh, that the seeds are going to sprout again soon and that there's new possibility. And around that time is, again, two, two, 2022. And as a number geek that I am, that's all about new beginnings. And we also just passed through new moon, dark moon. So a reset and a chance to journey in new beginnings with this next moon cycle. And uh, for me, what that's meant personally is like reclaiming some like queer expressive joy and color amidst all this snow white. Um, and as I sort of like, f this is my very first experiment with this new color palette. And oh my gosh, I'm kind of geeking out. It's fun. Um, because I acknowledge it's been a time, right? Like we've been still in these past two years with the global pandemic that's affecting each of us differently and yet huge shifts and changes surprising for so many of us. And, um, and my experience, and I know I'm not alone, is a lot of parched feeling, a lot of like dry, crispy loss of connection with vitality and joy and pleasure and you're not alone if you're feeling that like we're all in this together and uh what i want to invite is if that's if you're feeling kind of done and you'd like some support I'm, I'm offering a program that i that i offered for the first time last fall called remembering pleasure and remembering pleasure starts again march 2nd and it's been such a landing and coming home in my body of creating this program because it's everything that I um, feel and meet and journey with day to day. And what it is, is we're journeying with uh, the arc of three moon cycles. And it's to meet the, um, the very foundations that I believe support us into remembering that the world's got our back and it's going to be okay so that we can reclaim our juiciness and our pleasure. And those foundations are repairing our relationship with our bodies, each other, our community, nature, and our ancestors, our lines, and connection with spirit. So with that foundation... We are going to build on that and arc through these three cycles, attuning with the foundations and our ancestors, and then opening to release and be with the big energy of grief that helps us build, build resilience and capacity in our body so that we can remember and open to pleasure and know that that pleasure is available to us even in the midst of cold, cold weather <laughs> and dark, dark skies that we can find a little brightness and color and joy in all the ways that that means in our lives. Um, and remember to do that because we're connected and we have support of our community. So the course is um, going to be really limited to a, an intimately sized group. I, I um, limit the group size to eight people and we're gonna use a tool so that we really can um, stay connected online during the course of the course. So if this is really ringing for you, I encourage you to reach out, uh, fill out the interest chat form so that we can have a conversation 
and see if this is the right thing at the right time for us to work together in this way, which I'm excited about. Ah, yeah. Um, give yourself permission to slow down and remember and connect with these sweet resources that we have capacity to do so that we can remember that pleasure really is here and we can cultivate it in our lives. Mm, reach out soon. I would love to have that conversation. <laughs>